dan il-programm jidru xie prodotti kummerċjali. Wekko għasanna l-parti uħra tal-programm ġona unek għaddej ikompli xani dot għalli xetta mela unek il-basal. Tipprepara? Ehe, għaddej tinna naqra xetta mela. Mela, daka il-mili. Xina kurjuza jitna rakollu. Ezzat, dakwa il-mili li għannu zawu. Dekara, ehe. Fil-ħobs. Ċat, għajdudu, u xek. Daħaj kun fuq barra, u għawnek għamilt tomata u salid bil-yellow plums, u zatar, daħxej zejt ta' zabbuġa, biex jifriskar kel palat. Okej. Għalna, ekku, milli kel għanaddu għal suġġetti għar, danu għa personalita partikolari, bravissimu, u ma stajċ l-livdil l-skeda inħalliħ barra. Għanni l-aħmana ba' plawz kbir. U, ekku, welcome, Mike West. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Welcome to our show. Good, good. Nice to be here, nice to be here. Hi, yeah, yeah. Is it tough outside or? Yeah, yeah. Especially in like this little room here. Yeah, but it's good to be here. It's lovely to be here. Hello. I was telling our televiewers that I've met somebody. Okay. They've got a very, very interesting life, career, especially in the film industry. Okay. And I would like to start with talking about how you got into the film industry. Hmm. Mm. Okay. <laughs> how did I get into the film industry? Um, when I was, when I first came to Malta, I started. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Okay. Thank you. Cheers. Looks like Cheers. honey whiskey or something. Ah, no, no, Car whiskey what is in the morning. And the mint. Ah, nice. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Yeah. When I came to Malta first, they were shooting films there, a lot of films. I started as a mm -hmm. props painter. And then from a props painter, I tried, there was a, an audition for extras on set. And I said, oh, wow, I've got to do that. And I was covered in dirt. And I like, ran up and I, I tried to get uh, an audition to do it. And I didn't get the job. But then many years later, I think it was Sharon Stone. She, uh -huh. was, she was filming on the beach. And I remember looking and going, wow, that, that looks really fun. And, and I keep telling people she kind of gave me a little bit of a, a wave. I don't think she did, but in my mind she did. <laughs> And yeah, and then I just had dreams about going back on set, maybe because of mm -hmm. Sharon Stone, but mm -hmm. I had dreams about going back on set. And a couple of years later, I got the opportunity, there was an advert in a paper for um, someone to go on as an extra. Mm -hmm. And a friend of mine pushed me into it, and, and it was for Game of Thrones, and I got it. Huh. And it was a really mystical kind of way in which I got it, but uh -huh. uh, yeah, anyway. But you did the double of uh, yeah. various um, mm -hmm. actors. Yeah. Um, yeah. Which ones? Rob Lowe? Um, yeah. Which ones? So I've, mm -hmm. I've doubled for Christian Bale. Mm -hmm. I doubled for Christian Bale. I doubled for Rob Lowe. I doubled for... I kind of stood in for Joseph mm -hmm. Fiennes. Oh, yeah. Stood in for him. How it felt that you're... Uh, yeah, it was <laughs> kind of... Replacing somebody else. It was similar to this. I was uh -huh. slightly terrified. And uh, I, w I remember walking up mm -hmm. to him and he had these massive hands. By the way, Christian Bale has massive mm -hmm. hands, um, and he shook his hand, and he was just—he was a very nice guy, uh -huh. very nice guy. Let's watch um, yeah. uh, the images that you had sent. Okay. We have some oh, no. interesting photos, so let's watch them together. And uh, because I wish I have more time, but no, since we're uh, um, uh, concluding this yeah. series tomorrow, oh, but wow. I could not say no to you because I've been waiting and waiting. And thanks to Tony Parnis, I got to know you better. That's so what sweet. What can you tell us about? Oh, okay. So first, I uh -huh. basically, this is the photo I sent every potential date I go on. Mm -hmm. And it's basically me with Christian Bale there. Okay. And some sneaky friend of mine took a photo of it. Um, mm -hmm. So that's it. There's a photo of Christian Bale on set. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is me. Okay, this is me doing improv. That's Andrew yes, Panella. Yes, yes. He was here there. a few days He's, ago. He was over here. That's uh -huh. him. Okay, and this is the Island Film Gathering. So I did a, a, a thing called the Island Film Gathering. Maybe mm -hmm. I could talk about that. And that's a guy standing up there. So this was a networking event for Malta where we got all the people in film together to, mm -hmm. to network, basically. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's, that's outside us all standing outside and looking at it. Yeah. That's it. Ooh, that's another, okay. Yeah, this, this is one. this is a film I made, which mm -hmm. got with uh, Joe Paolo, and that got in Loving Malta. So yeah. that was a good one. Very happy about that. Mm -hmm. um, more? Okay. 
I think that's going it. Going to, in few minutes' time, yes. we are also going to watch. You had um, yeah. a lot of different um, uh, participations, mm. in different commercials. In fact, I told you yeah. I cannot show uh, the branding of the companies, yeah, but. True. I watched them all and yeah. uh, it was amazing. Yeah. How do you feel then from the film industry, yeah. then you go into the commercial sector? Yeah, I, I'm re I really so feel... So you do the storyboard yourself or you ju were just taking part in it? Yeah, I was just taking uh -huh. part in it. I was taking part in it and basically uh, I've done... I, I started out doing an advert for Melita uh -huh. and then I did a lot of different adverts. Yeah. Um, yeah, and I've been, uh, mm -hmm. you could maybe yes, see, see them. Yes, let's yeah. watch them, let's watch them yeah, together. Yeah, it's easier than them. It's a very, very interesting. Yeah, there's that one. Mm -hmm. That was on, that was everywhere for a while. It was lots of posters, I irritated my friends. There were so many <laughs> shots of me doing as me jumping around on the couch. There you go. Mm -hmm. um, it's a lot of fun. Really grateful. That's a little girl. She was a brilliant okay. actress. And there's uh, Chris Dingley. Okay, good yeah, actor. I remember him also, yeah. They said look tired here. Mm -hmm. That was easy. Um, so there's another guy, uh, Jovan <laughs> Pazani, sat by me here. There he is, cuddling me. That's one I just did for Me Direct now, which was a lot mm -hmm. of fun. A lot of fun there. Yeah. It is how I've done a lot. I've done a lot. The, this uh, kind of work. Does yeah. it take long to finish an advert? Like the preparation yeah. of it, you discuss the storyboard. How does it work? No, so they basically... Mm -hmm. so they tell you what to do? They tell you what to do. What That's to say? Yeah. <laughs> it's interesting. Wow. Well. Quite a lot. Quite a lot. <laughs> My, um, John, can I have some water, please? Thank you. Yeah. Do you, do you have any more water, actually? Uh -huh. to talk? Yeah. No, I'm, I'm being pushy now. Sorry. It's no. okay. No problem. No All problem. Right. We'll get you some water. All right. Cheers. Because it's a bit concentrated. I told you. <laughs> no, it's I good. told him already. I told him. For me, it's a bit too... Concentrated, yeah. I would like no, some more lovely. water. Um, um, yeah. So let's continue talking about your career. I remember yeah. that there was a concert, Brian Adams, and it's like he inspired you. Something ah. happened. Ah, yeah, I told you uh -huh. that, yeah. Okay, so yeah, when I was, uh, when I was a lot younger, basically there was, uh, mm -hmm. there was uh, when I wanted to get into Thank film. You. Mm -hmm. Thanks a lot. Basically, Brian, so I'm part Maltese. Right? And I've always been trying to find my roots. Everyone's like, ah, oh, this guy's Maltese. <laughs> yeah, I'm part Maltese, I swear to God. Okay. Uh, and well, I was always trying to find my roots. And mm -hmm. Brian Adams is a bit Maltese too. And so I said, ah, I'm going to go and see Brian Adams because he's a bit Maltese and I can connect to this guy, likes his music, he's great. And then I remember when I went to, I went to go and see him on stage and we couldn't afford it. So I was with my girlfriend and I was outside kind of looking through the bars. Um, at it and I remember seeing him perform mm -hmm. and when he was performing I I just completely connected with what he was doing um, mm. okay. and, wow. and I felt uh -huh. and, I, and I realized wow I want to be a Sometimes performer. Sometimes things happen for a reason. Maybe. Right. Yeah. So I that's... was telling the same thing to yeah. uh, Tonio Bonello. Yeah. So we have another yeah. clip okay. a film that you made um, Stake and A Better Life Shall we watch it together? Do you give us... So, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I think the clip I gave you is of A Better mm -hmm. Life and of mm -hmm. the other one I made, which yeah. is called Staked. Yeah, you can see it, basically. Mm -hmm. So this one's called Staked. I made this with Joe Paolo. There's Anthony Mitzi in there. Mm -hmm. That's him as a vampire mm -hmm. over there. Um, oops. So the visual effects. The, there's the visual uh, effects. Really good. It was... Just left my oops, oops, that's a bit loud. Oh. <laughs> and this one's... <laughs> <laughs> I should have cut out the swearing. Anyway, but this is an improv film, so all of the dialogue in that was all of the dialogue in that was improvised. Everything was made up on the spot. We, yeah, mm -hmm. and it's called about yeah. aliens and stuff. Yeah, and it's an improv comedy. This is a comedy. very, very interesting. I love short films, and do you? Uh, yeah, I do. I do. What, what do you in like fact, about I short have, films? Yeah. I have Tony Parnis mm. who. I invite him every now and then. Yeah. I've seen so many, and uh, this is why I wanted you to come to my okay. show. And yeah. I would like to close hmm. with the short video of Quarantine Film Creation. Okay. Right? So, shall I us? just tell you, like, the last really, one, because we're I'm going to shut up really quickly. Uh -huh. 
Thank you for having me on, by welcome, the way. Thank welcome, you you're welcome. Um, so basically, um, this mm -hmm. one's quarantine film festival that uh, lights camera quarantine mm -hmm. in quarantine. There was we have I have a group called Film TV Work mm -hmm. Malta. By the way, check it out if you all want to <laughs> get into film. It's called Film TV Work uh -huh. Malta. Yes. And in that group, we asked everyone to um, make a film together, mm -hmm. and they made a film from home, and we presented it. We had okay. six films. One of them won three awards. Um, wow. There's six films, and mm -hmm. yeah, you can. This is us presenting it. I think. Yeah, when you look back at your career, yeah. like, <laughs> when I look are you back happy, at it, or you would like to? I'd like to do some more. Do I'd like something. To do yeah. something. Uh -huh. I don't know. What is it? You have something in mind? Mm. Mm. I would like to make another improv film. So, if there's any improv actors mm -hmm. out there, if there's any people who want to make some films, uh -huh. this man actually <laughs> helped me with one of my films. This guy, over here. Yeah. This, this guy oh. over here, Luke. He's a. He, uh -huh. You know each other. Yeah. He's a great floor. He's, He's floor manager. I really trust him. Film, I trust film. him completely. Well, shall we watch yeah. the, the film? Sure. Okay, let's watch uh, it together. Sorry, the Sorry, film is about a fictional That's... virus that causes the victim to go insane. And it's, it's about a young man who's in quarantine and it's the last few days of the <laughs> After six months of lockdown, the government has announced that quarantine will be lifted on Sunday. Can you believe it? But, do you really think that it's over? That, that it's safe? Why? Have you been listening to that conspiracy crap again? What's that, soapbox? No, uh, it's... I don't know. It just seems a bit sudden, that's all. Nobody's shown symptoms in a month. Yeah, it's time. We're finally gonna get our life back. Remember life, Vila? Hmm. Wish I'd experienced more of it while I still could. Damn it, Amy. <laughs> when this is over, we really need to do stuff. Like? I just know you didn't. The sort of things we've been talking about for months. I had so many guests here that uh, during quarantine, mm. they did great work. Incredible. It's true. It's really true, right? Eh? Oh. It was very inspiring, a good time uh -huh. to do, exactly. to make things, and yeah, so that was it. Mike, I would Tell like me. to thank you so much. I'm thank inviting you, you I appreciate in the near future, for sure, because appreciate. I wish I had more time. Honestly, I feel a bit guilty. No. <laughs> um, but today I had so many guests. Thank you so much. Yes. I really appreciate you having me on. Is thank there you. something that you wish to say, that you have yes. something in mind that you would like to, yeah. to flourish maybe in the near future? Yeah, can I mm -hmm. say, um, yes. number one, join the group, Film TV Work Malta, it's 20k people. But in that group, there is a guy called Franco Rizzo who's trying to promote his film. Mm -hmm. He's a Maltese filmmaker and he needs support from Kickstarter. So if you want to help him, it's in that group. And thank you to everyone who helped me get to this point. I really appreciate it. And you yes. and everyone. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you for coming. I have thank to you. join John, our chef, because we're coming near to the end. Vera, John, are they in? Mamma yes. mia. Illum Vera, Miskin Philip, Illum Asquazi, Hellum Tech Canta, and Miss Patia, that are the Hikona. Aktar hin anke ma telespetta tuuri. Kellem na fuq xie purta. Ada ghaj kolli kju aw aw barra jina. Ada ghaj kolli kju tanis di ghlina jist eda in arar. Mela, għanna rawissa il-mistidna. Il-li missu a Francesca!